Hey, what's up, you two? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can beat the stock market in a recession by this little trick that we call Leap Options. Now, this might be the best time to buy Leap Options because there's a lot of stocks out there. There's a lot of companies out there that are undervalued right now. Not all of them are undervalued, but a couple of them are undervalued, and the Leap Options is the perfect strategy to get in on at the right time when some of these companies are undervalued and you expect them to be trading at a higher price years down the line. I'm gonna show you guys how this strategy is actually better than buying 100 shares of any given company and how you can lower your risk because you're gonna be getting in on lower capital with less capital, guys. So a lot of you guys are asking, what are LEAP options, L-E-A-P? Well, it stands for a long-term, equity anticipation securities now leaps are options that typically have the expiration date that is out further than a year and if you think the stock is going to be trading and the economy is going to be trading at a higher price two years down the line from now then leap options is the way to go and, and it's going to be even cheaper than buying shares of a company and you guys can make a ton of money because once again it is option i'm going to be showing you guys a couple of examples how you could buy leap options today two different companies that are undervalued to me and how much money you can make from these plays but before we dive into it this video is brought to you by Webull. Sign up now by clicking the link down in the description, deposit any amount of money, even one penny guys, and you will receive now six free stocks, six free stocks. This is the most they've ever given away. You get six free stocks just from depositing one penny. And those stocks are valued up to $9,300. With those six free stocks, you could keep them inside the platform and decide to use it. Or you could sell those six free stocks and withdraw all of your money. Guys, it's literally free money. Do not miss out on that amazing opportunity. That is the best way to survive in a stock market crash is to get free stocks. Also, I left a link down in the description to Coinbase. That is by far the easiest way to buy and sell cryptocurrency. I left a code to Coinbase down there. But from using that code, you get $10 free worth of Bitcoin by using the, my code down in the description. And the last link I'm going to leave in the description is to Moomoo. Sign up with Moomoo and deposit $100 and you'll get five free stocks valued up to $9,300. Once again, with those five free stocks you could keep them inside the platform and decide to use it or you could sell those five free stocks and with your all of your money guys it's literally free money do not miss out on these amazing opportunities but enough talking let's go ahead and dive straight into this video Welcome back dreamers. Here we are on the first company we're gonna look at is Robinhood, ticker symbol H-O-O-D. Now over the year, they was one point average trading around $40 on Robinhood, even though they was almost getting shorted at one point, but the average price was around $40, $30. Now, Robinhood is down 73% on the year, all the way to $10.02. Now, to me, that is undervalued, and that is why I want to do a leap option on Robinhood. So let me show you guys how to go and do a leap option. So you wanna hit trade, trade options, and then at the top is the expiration date. Now remember, a leap option is anything that's over a year expiring from today. Now you could do January 20, 2023. That is not a year from today. You wanna go even further out to January 19, 2024. So that's almost two full years, guys, of us putting in an option leap on Robinhood, expecting that it's gonna be trading at a higher price two years from now. Now we're on the buy call. As you guys can see, I already have a $10 um, leap on Robinhood expiring in 2024. Right now, if you try to buy 100 shares of Robinhood, it will cost you $1,000 to get 100 shares of Robinhood. But let's say you don't have the capital, you're new to investing, you don't have um, $1,000 to put up, but let's say you do have $400, then, then you could buy this leap option right here, expiring January 19, 2024, the $10 call, and your break even price is $13.98. That means two years from now, if Robinhood is above $13.98, remember Robinhood was once trading at $30, $40, so two years from now, if you believe that Robinhood is going to be above $13.98, then this is the way for you to go. Now, this is called buying in the money when you're buying a strike price that is not at the current price of the company. 
And let's say if you want to do the $13 call, that is called buying out of the money. That, that means Robinhood is not quite at $13 yet, so it got a ways to go. It will, it will be cheaper. Let's say you only had $200. Um, you want to buy the $20 call out of the money. It will be cheaper, but your break even price is now $21.91. So, so you want to believe that Robinhood um, in January 19, 2024 is going to be above $21.91. So the other company that we're going to look at in this video is Disney DIS. Now, of course, Disney over the last year is down 40.52%. I love the company Disney. I love everything that they're doing with Marvel. So um, one point in time, Disney was trading at a stock price of around $200, $197. So all the way from $200 to $100, um, Disney down 40%. Even though it could pull back some more, we're not at the bottom of the recession yet, I don't believe. But once Disney go under $100, let's say it's go down to $99.99, that would be a good buying opportunity. At the recording of this video, Disney is at $102, but if it does pull back um, underneath $100 by the time this video comes out, I'm going to try to put in a leap option on Disney. Remember to buy 100 shares of Disney uh, for $102. That would cost you $10,000 to buy 100 shares of Disney. Now, let's see if we want to do a leap option on Disney. Aspiring January 19th, 2024. Okay, so quick technical analysis. You don't want to go in blind just because a company is down 40% like Disney. You actually want to look at their support and resistance lines. And as you guys can see, Disney does look like it's having a little quick double bottom right here. Um, around the $99 price point. So there's going to be a little support line for Disney, even though we're in a recession, I think it's going to pull back further than that, but we're just going to wait for Disney to pull back underneath $99. Now this is a ridge right here. You guys can see all the other support and resistance lines I have drawn out. I will post that inside the discord. Um, that link is going to be down in the comment section, but yeah, we're going to do, um, technical analysis on every leap option before we actually go in and buy it to make sure that it is at a price point that we're willing to enter it at and everything and everything that's set up looks okay like i said i want to do it under 100 dollars, so i would look at the 95 call that would cost me two thousand three hundred and fifty eight dollars so if you don't have the capital of ten thousand dollars of playing with 100 shares um, now you could do the same thing of trading with 100 shares by just having $2,358 on Disney and the break even price is $118. Now I'm show you guys exactly how much you can make by pulling up the option profit calculator. So let's go ahead and pull that up. All right, so here we are on the option profit calculator. Let's do Disney first and then we'll do Robinhood get price. So we're just doing a long call bullish on this and then we're gonna select the option. We're gonna go all the way out to nine, the 19th of January, 2024. And we said that we was gonna do the 95 call. So let's go ahead and hit calculate and show you guys. Now the quicker that the stock price goes up, the better. Let's say as it goes up and recover all the way back up to $200. By the end of January this year, 2023, you'll be up $8,698 in profit up 30 up 369%. Now that is way better than buying 100 shares of Disney. But let's say Disney just ends up going from $100 to $140. You will still be in profit up 108%, doubling your money just from Disney going from $100 to $140 compared to you buying 100 shares of Disney. Now let's say the longer, the quicker it goes up, the better, but the longer you hold on to it, um, the IV does start to drop and you will make less money, but you can still end up profiting over 90%. This from Disney being a better company two years from now. So if you don't think Disney is gonna be a better company two years from now, then leaps, or then this company is not the company that you wanna do a leap on, but you are getting in at a cheaper price. Remember, you are lowering your risk, you are lowering your um, capital, by doing leap options compared to buying 100 shares of these companies outright. So leap, so leap options eliminate you having to check the stock market every single day. Um, you set it, um, you check on it every now and then, it's gonna expire two years from now. If it's at a uh, if it's at a profit that you guys wanna take early, then you guys can, but if you wanna expire it out. All right, so let's check out Robinhood since it is a little cheaper. So let's take, type in hood, get the price and select option. Remember, expiring 19th January, 2024 and we're going to select the ten dollars and it's going to cost us 397 dollars compared to us it compared to it costing one thousand dollars we're going to hit calculate in fact let's 25 let's say robin hood go all the way back up to thirty dollars hit calculate 
And there we go, guys. If Robinhood shoots all the way back up to thirty dollars by mid twenty twenty three, you'll be you'll be up four hundred and seven percent. You would you would have turned three hundred and ninety seven dollars and made a profit of one thousand six hundred and seventeen dollars, up four hundred percent. Now that is the power of leap options. Now let's say Robinhood only goes from ten dollars to around fourteen dollars over the next two years, guys. It only goes up on um, four dollars over the next two years then you will still be in profit it won't be a super major profit so let's say it goes up to 15 dollars you'll still be up what 25 percent now um six to seven percent is a is a great gain inside the stock market every year every year but just in about a year and a half you will be up 25 percent which, which is 25 percent is pretty good 103 dollars is not profit is not anything to be like super excited about but you did not lose any money and you got in at a cheaper price and you don't have to check the stock market every single day so leap options is one of my major plays when the stock market is crashing i go in i find these good companies uh, thinking that they'll shoot up at least halfway back up to that all-time high so let's just say 20 dollars ish i think robin hood will be around 20 dollars two years from now so i could have a profit of around 175 uh, percent over the next two years. And there we go, dreamers. That is one of the plays that I do inside the stock market is when it's crashing. I find good quality companies, a little risky one with Robinhood, a good quality one with Disney. I find them undervalued. I cannot wait until Apple goes undervalued by a major price. I'm gonna definitely put in a leap option on them because I really think that Disney and Robinhood is gonna be a better company and trading at a higher price than they are right now. One is, one is down 50% on the year and the other is now 40 percent on the year so i do think that two years from now that they should be able to at least recover halfway from dropping down 40 percent over the last couple of months inside of this recession but yeah guys if you do want to know when i buy my options my leaps you could check that out in the comment section uh, that'll take you to my patreon the patreon to take you to my discord inside of my discord i post every single time i buy and sell the stocks i post my option trades in there my technical analysis we also have pro traders in there that post every all of their options Option trades every single day inside there and you'll be a part of the best community of traders that have the same mindset of you of investing into their knowledge investing into their sales in order to become financially free so if you want to be a part of a great community uh, check that link out down in the comment section to join the discord but yeah guys go down to the comment section let me know what other stocks are undervalued that i should probably look at in order to do a leap option on have you heard of leap options before have you done one before if you've done a leap option let me know how did that turn out for you down in the comment section even though the stock market is pulling back a lot of options aren't looking too good right now but let me know if you have had a successful leap option down in the comment section i can't wait to check out what you guys write down below and hit that thumbs up button but other than that, I'm Zeke, bringing you the Dream Green Show. I'm out. Peace.